G'day Starlo here. We all love getting great screen images off our Lorances and sharing them with our mates or on social media or whatever. They're really useful, especially to me because I use them in articles and also in blogs on our fishertopia.com website and various other things, presentations, whatever. It's great to have good screenshots. But this is how most people capture them. They grab their phone or their camera and they take a photo of the screen. Look, sometimes you get reasonable results, but other times it can be a dead loss. Dirty screens, your own reflection, you can miss out on that cracker screenshot. Have a look at this one of a saltwater crocodile. Not a bad image, but it would have been so much better if we didn't have the reflection of the angler in the background. Luckily, most Lowrance units allow you to actually capture the image straight off the screen. On most of them, it's just a matter of simultaneously pressing the pages and power button, like this. You can do it with one hand, but it's actually a little bit easier if you use two hands. Once they're captured, they're stored in the unit's memory and you can download them onto a micro SD card and transfer them to your computer or whatever. I'll show you how to do that in a minute, but first, here's a great little trick. Because I take so many screenshots, I've actually programmed my pages key to take screenshots on a long press and hold. This is really easy to set up. You just press and hold the pages key and it brings you to the quick access menu. From there, you can assign one of a number of available functions to your pages key. If you've got one of the bigger live units, there are four more quick access keys you can program as well. But on the seven and nine units, it's just the pages key that's programmable. Okay, so now my pages key is programmed. It still takes me to the pages menu on a short press, but if I hold it down, it captures a screenshot. And I know it's done that because the file name appears down here on the screen. Now, when you want to get your screenshots off your unit and take them to your computer or whatever, you just need to insert a micro SD card into one of the slots here. Then go to the main menu and scroll down to files and select it. Touch my files and we can see screenshots. Touch that and all your saved screenshots can be opened and viewed on there. Get rid of any that you don't like the ones that you do want to keep can be saved individually to that micro SD card, or you can save the lot by touching this drop down arrow and selecting copy all, then choosing where you want them to go. Okay, once they're on the card, you can take it out, plug it into a card reader and download it to your computer or whatever. There are even devices that let you transfer these files straight onto your mobile phone where you can save them or you can send them to your mates right away if you can't wait until you get off the water. So there you go, capturing professional quality screen images off your Lowrance units is dead easy. But one little tip, you might not want to share images that have got GPS or location data clearly displayed on them. Not unless you like fishing with crowds anyway, bear that in mind. Until next time, this is Starlo wishing you tight lines.